Installing the master door sash. The master door is identified easily. It has prep holes in the section for door handle assemblies, it has a door lock in the side of the sash and has compression blocks fitted to the pivot side of the sash. The door handles should be fitted prior to installing the door. On the hinge side of the door, the upper pin assembly should be removed by undoing the two bolts using a ball end 3 16 Allen key. Please note, no power tools should be used in either removing or fitting these assemblies at the top of each sash. Utilizing two people, position the master door at right angles to the frame close to the bottom pivot hole of the track. The door handle side should be farthest from the frame. Tilt the top of the sash away from the frame. Then carefully lift the sash to allow location of the bottom pin on the sash into the bottom pivot hole of the track. Then insert the previously removed upper pin assembly into the pivot hole on the top track and offer the sash to the pin assembly and reattach the fixings using the 3 16 Allen key previously mentioned. Don't use power tools to attach the assembly. With the master door still in the open position, remove the restrictor arm screw and washer from the top track. Then swing the restrictor arm from the top of the master door into position over the hole and reaffix the screw and washer. Again, it is important to only use hand tools to remove and reaffix the restrictor arm assembly.